Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel Captec Pro. In this video, we will see how to set up out of office on Microsoft Teams. So friends, let's go to our lab environment and let's start our today's video demonstration. So friends, before we proceed to our lab environment, if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel yet, please do subscribe and please press the bell icon to get notified every time I release a new video. Okay friends, so now we are on our Microsoft Teams uh, application. This is the application which is installed on my PC. However, the demonstration which we are you know, now going to perform that can be done on the um, browser as well. So uh, in order to set the uh, like the main purpose of setting an out of office, you know, status is, is to just let your, you know, organization members in, on, you know, your colleagues to know that you are on vacation and you won't be able to, you know, reply on time and, you know, do the stuff like that. So in order to set a out of office status, first of all, you have to click on this, you know, your name. Here you will get an option of set in status message. So you can uh, enter the status message over here as well as uh, for scheduling the out of office there is a link over here you can click on it and you will be navigating to that page however there is a one more method to go to the uh, for scheduling the out of office is that you have to click on this three dots uh, click on settings here uh, under the journal if you will scroll all the way to bottom you will see option of out of office and scheduling it so once you will click on schedule uh, basically what happens once you you know schedule out of office it gets sync with your outlook calendar as well so if in case uh, once you will select toggle this on uh, once uh, you know any person will send you an important email and they they will be expecting you to just reply to them so you can you know set a message over here like uh, hello i will be currently on vacation please expect a delay on the response so you can read that over here like it will be getting sync with our outlook calendar as well so once you will type your you know out of office mom message like let me type hello i will be oof and and will resume on like for example i will resume on 24th april so you can type these kind of you know out of office message uh, then you have the option to send the replies outside of your organization you can select this box so if you want you can select only to my contacts or like you want an external senders to you know receive it so you can type your message here similarly then uh, there is another option which is the last option to send the replies only the during a time period like once you will select it you can select the uh, duration of your out of office like on from which date until when you want to get it scheduled so say for example from today onwards i'm going you know i will be out of office you can, we can select the end date as well so once you will select it you can click on save okay so you can view it as well if you want to make any modification rest if you will click on cancel and let me tell you how it will it will look like you could see this is my message okay which user will generally see however if i will you know just appear offline this kind of you know my out of office status will look like similarly uh, the user will be you know once they will be sending you mail on outlook they will be receiving and you know the message as well the automatic replies so friends that's how we can schedule out of office on microsoft teams and the automatic replies on outlook let's conclude our video demonstration for more informative videos you can check my other video links on the screen and subscribe my channel and press bell icon for more upcoming videos. I will see you guys in next video.